Hello, I'm Chris with Atlantic Drain. Today, we're doing a sump pump to drain install, as well as a downspout to drain install. And now we're taking it out here to the main line and tying into our new line going out to the street. You want to prep the area, of course, and the first thing you need to do is put on a donut coming over this one and a half inch pipe. This one I've modified. I've actually taken the lip off the bottom side of that donut. Can you see that in there? There's a small lip. And I've just cut that out. So after you've cut that lip of this donut off, then you want to just slide it up on top of the discharge pipe for the sump pump. You can put it way up there. That's a really nice thing. And we're going to have this directly underneath it, coming out to the main line. We got a 3x4 reducer or enlarger in this case. And we're just going to put that over top of that donut. You can still see the pipe here is exposed. So we're going to cut a piece that comes from uh, this joint here all the way up into the lip of the 3x4 pipe adapter. So I'm just going to get a rough measurement here. Cut me a piece of pipe. That's looking pretty good. Because once again, this is all adjustable up here. That's the nice thing about having that donut the way it is adjust it. So I like to glue my fittings up that are you know around the house and I use OD. This one's the all-purpose cement and it's in the red and white container and it's the one that you'll see first at the hardware store. This works great. This is the only fitting that you're doing at this point. Don't glue anything else. Just get that in there real good and tight. And then get to where you about to where you want it. Just slide that over it for now. Now we're going to work on that downspout to drain. This is a tight fit, but it's going to be just right. I'm going to slide a 2x3x4 pipe adapter onto the spout. And I'm going to cut a piece of pipe. It just needs to be rough. You know, 4 inch pipe is a wonderful thing. It fits up over top of the downspout fairly easily. Oh yeah, about right there. Next fitting that we're going to glue is that 90 degree elbow that's going on up here to the downspout. And there's no true glue that will chemically bond polyethylene to polystyrene. And that's what this is, polyethylene. And the fittings are polystyrene. It does work real good to hold it together and in place while you're working on it. And that's what we want. So I've cut in the depth wise pretty, pretty deep here where I'm going to actually lift the whole system up an inch or two after I get it put together. So you don't want to glue this fitting. You can see this is a pretty tight fit. 
it's going to work out just fine. Just nice, small pieces in between. Good, generous amount on your fittings. seals it up real nice but again it's not a true chemical bond but I like using it it really makes it watertight while you're putting it in the ground and once it's settled it's not going to move which is good side of the tee for sump pump input. Oh that's nice. It's going to be perfect. I like it. So we've got a nice seal, nice bond. On everything going into this pipe system. The methods that I've shown you in this video are fail safe. You will never have to worry about sump pump to drain separation or downspout to drain separation. Let's go ahead and hook up that 4 inch pipe going out to the street. In these next few steps I'm going to show you a fantastic way to cut and save your sod. This one line prepping tip will save you time and money. Don't cut corners trying to rush through the line prepping process. Saving your sod not only saves you money, it also saves you an unnecessary trip to the garden store. Check out the link at the end of this video to learn the secret of saving your sod. I'm Chris with Atlantic Drain reminding you, it's easy once you know how.